Yo, what's up, guys, and welcome back to the What's Good podcast, sponsored Woo. by Prime. Woo! Woo. That's you know that's peak. We not, have a not. guest, and this is the first oh. time, bro. Sometimes it's just me and you, and you go, "I'm here with Simon." <laughs> true. To be fair, you guest. are scraping the bottom of the barrel, though. So you know, yeah, yeah, it's yeah, true. So it's we, have, we have John on cam. Con wasn't available. Yeah. <laughs> no, but this is his first time on the podcast on his own. That's true. Yeah, I'm going to see if I can hold up the views without Con because last time oh. they did all right. With I, I, reckon, Con. I, reckon, I reckon you can, you know. Everyone knows what Con wants to say. No one knows what you got to say. You are the most involved person with the Sidemen, I would say. Yes. I think I, we talked about this before, but last year I was on involved in more Sidemen main channel videos than even uh, any of the Sidemen. Because you got think, what, oh, what, when we split up, you yeah, like, like something like the hot and cold. Oh, you, we're not trying to get you hey. ahead of the side. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I knew him before he was famous. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. He filmed. I, I knew him when he. Um, Con was like, oh, "I've got this little loser who keeps tag- tagging along with me." Mm. Like, that was f- last week. <laughs> that was that was how I told him to pitch me as well. So that's good. <laughs> really? Yeah. 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 Loser. Yeah. Well, yeah, because you film more side men, side men, side plus. Mm-hmm. You don't film side memory acts. No. Nope. So technically, you're not as involved as the side men. No, yeah, as a, oh, I did specify main channel though. Main channel. Main channel I've been on. Because of things like Hot and Cold Camping, I was on both teams. True. You, but you aren't. Maybe I was. You know, I found, well, you know what I like, right? I like this, this, this thing when, like, we talk to John all the time. All the time. He's like nervous now. <laughs> oh, yeah, big time. Yeah, big time. Like, hey, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not as nervous as last time because last time I was way more nervous. And Con brought it up in the middle of the yeah, podcast. True. He was like, hey, relax. And I was like, oh, that's helping. <laughs> I like seeing people people squirm, man. It's funny. That's because we talk to you every like every That's time we do. So sadistic. Every time we do podcast, you're just stood, stood there, you know. <laughs> I am and you actually talk more there than you do now, probably. Yeah, probably. Always putting in with their mic. Yeah, but you're the, you know you guys are the host, <laughs> so I'm just waiting for I'm just waiting for the questions to fly over this way. Ah. Well, we are three men in different stages of having kids. That is true. Was in I'm not having a kid yet. All oh, right. He's about to have oh, a kid. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And okay. you have a kid. I, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. John's pr- having a baby. I, it was a lot of hard work, yeah. But and it could happen any second because uh, I don't know why I've just kind of, I haven't posted anything or said anything, but yes, yeah, it's been nine months now. So it's within the next two weeks. Jeez. Wow. So it could happen now. I could have to leave now and go and do it. Do you it. know the gender? No, it's a surprise. We did have a fire alarm. Yeah, we did have a fire alarm. That could have been the baby. That could, yeah, could yeah, have been. That could have been on the phone, like, yo, what's good? That could have been the gender announcement somehow. We could have got outside and then. <laughs> fire alarm. Would you yeah. say that would be a boy or a girl? I'd say a boy. Yeah. The fire's cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that. I I'd go that. Girl, not cool. <laughs> Girl's boring, man. Well, but, well that isn't like, you know. But yeah, no, I'm, okay. I'm mate. <laughs> <laughs> you also have a daughter. No, I have a daughter. Yeah, yeah, I have a daughter. <laughs> <laughs> Um, obviously, it doesn't matter which one no. you have, but do you have a thought or a preference? Um, no, but ultimately, I'm going to love them the same and raise them the same. Yeah, well, we know all yeah, the boys. Yeah, all, yeah, all the spiel, yeah, yeah all the spiel. <laughs> Probably would prefer a boy just because, I don't know, I feel like boys have it a lot easier, generally. Wow. You know? Like, yeah, well, I, feel, I feel like they do. I feel like I'd want my Cancel daughter to him. go through a lot of the shit that the girls have to go through that boys do. So no, you're not wrong. You're that's not wrong. as easy as that. But as well, I, I can't imagine, because girls often go after guys like their dad, right? What? I can't. Well, that's what people no, say, right? Thing, that married. is a thing. It's the same, same the other way around, though. Yeah, but the thing is, I can't imagine if I'm my not daughter brought my home. My you basically, are yeah. Okay. Laura so has very <laughs> mum-like uh, tendencies towards you. She does look after you a lot. True. She doesn't look like my mum though. Doesn't look, look like different. her. Behave, not to you, like <laughs> but to us. <laughs> to us, yeah. We talk about it. <laughs> It's probably the most awkward podcast I've ever seen. It's because you just realised you're, you're married to your mum. Nah, I'm not though. <laughs> I would. What? <laughs> like, nah, I just imagine like watching TV would be good, you know? Like, Did you have a preference? Yeah, did you have a preference? On my mum? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> like, when just before you had your child. Oh, no, I, I wanted to go. You wanted to go? Yeah, I actually did. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, boys are so sweaty, man. Sweaty. <laughs> Sweaty, <laughs> snotty, snotty, snotty. No, they are like like five that years old. True. Like, well, I fucking hate that man. Just go and play with like some just, some Lego or something, man. It's like trying to like <laughs> put your finger up your nose and shit, man. Yeah, no, nah, I, I actually wanted a girl. I actually did. I mean, I, the thing is, I've always said like I want a boy. Like, if I had to choose one, I would go for a boy. To continue the name, but I actually don't care about. I, I don't care about that anymore. Like, continue nah, the name. What does that mean? It's like eight million people. It's the same as like you're saying. Oh, king. I'd probably say a boy, but mm. you don't care. Like, no, nah, nah. it's not going to change. Nah, yeah, and once course, once yeah. they're born, it's like okay. Mm-hmm. My question is now, now that you've had one, because I'm thinking about, because I want multiple kids. All right, yeah. Now you've had one and you've had time with it. Yeah. How quickly, do you do you even want other kids and how quickly are you going to have other kids? Do you want so another kid? about the gap? Um, I guess, yeah, I would like another kid. But 
I'm not really, no, I'm not like, I'm not like, oh, we're ready yet, you know? Mm. Just seeing how it goes. But now you've had a girl, mm. would you want another girl or would you want a boy? I'm not sure what I can say here because like my brother, uh, okay, maybe we'll take this out. My brother has had two girls and a boy. Okay. And my sister's had two girls and she had a boy literally like two days ago. Mad. Yeah, that's why I'm, that's why I had to drive myself today. My fucking dad is looking after the baby. Can't. Selfish. God, yeah, so that selfish, selfish, right? Yeah. That's bad, that's mad, that's man. poor. And my yeah, mum has to go as well, so she can't pack orders. Mate. Laura. No. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you did that. Because of the earlier, the earlier situation. Yeah. So I didn't bring it back. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, no, so yeah, uh, Girl Girl Boy. So I guess if we copied that, it'd be Girl Girl Boy as well. Mad. But, mm. you know, TBD. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> to be decided, right? <laughs> Determined. Uh, decided? Either. It could be both. Do you feel anyway. you're a good dad? Yeah. Yeah. Well, how, how, well, are you you how, how are you? You said that with like. No, I, I mean, I'm how are you dad. assessing that? What metrics are you using? Um, I just make a laugh all the time. Jamie uh, seemed to think that he was a way better dad than you. Yeah, he is. He definitely is, though. You know? <laughs> I, I saw him at Ethan's um, engagement party, like running around with the kid. I don't, I'm, I'm just like, shoo, you know. <laughs> Go find some dirt. No, no. On a real, on a real though, I'm a good dad. Yeah. But the thing is, like, Laura is really good. She's like a very, very good mum. So mm. she just does everything. So, like, for example, my dad looked after Harper the other day, um, and like, <laughs> well, dad, if you watch this, it's not personal. But Laura said that when she came <laughs> back, he like the the baby girl wasn't on properly. Right. You know? And then like the nappy was like, off a little bit. Whereas like, so like, for example, with me, like Laura will take control of like a lot of the feeding, a lot of the, you know, nappy changes just because she's better, you know? Mm. Yeah, I've had that when like, when, when I was at my house and I used to live with my mum, like I'd be like, do you want me to do the dishwasher? And she's like, I, d I don't want you to do that. Yeah, I have a feeling Kelly's gonna do the same, yeah. <laughs> no. Oh, well you just did it. You did it well. No, she hated I, the way I, I barely did it, did it but. If, if I said, oh, would you want me to do it? They'd be like, yes, oh, yeah. finally. Nah, my mum would never say yes. Laura would never say yes. Like even like, even like washing my clothes. I did my clothes the other day. And um, the similarity between your mum and Laura. That's yeah, cool. they do take care of me. Yes, but is, no, I was like, here. I was drying my own. I actually really enjoyed, by the way. You should try it guys. What? Washing your own clothes. It's actually really therapeutic. Are you assuming we've never washed our own clothes? I know you have. I have. Wait, why me and not him? <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? Like you insulted both of us so well there. <laughs> I know. You, you made him seem like, like I, know. I know you have. <laughs> it's probably the worst podcast I've ever done. Why? Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't it's know, good. mate. It's obvious. Come on. No, no, no. Cause I wasn't really excited for this. Oh, was you? No, I actually was. Yeah, you oh. said you were script viral. I'm actually not. Oh, actually well, not. Because I, I thought that. it'd be really entertaining, but it's just like the vibes not right. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> I was well, enjoying it, and now you've brought the you brought, you brought the, the vibe. Is, the, is, the, is this is it different in here? No, I think it's because I'm sat here, not over there. Because we it's, it's too much for you. You can't handle it. We haven't had a guest for six weeks. No, it's because we know the guest, but like yeah. they're being different than they normally are. <laughs> There's a lot more pressure. No, it's fine. But it's wait, fine. you said about the three different stages, right? Now that you've seen us two going through the stages of having a baby, how does it make you feel? Is it making you a lot more like, oh, I could do that because these two could do it? Do, let me ask you a question as well before we get to that one. Do you actually think I have a baby? It doesn't feel like it, right? It feels like nothing's changed. Well, nothing's changed. No, I, I actually, okay, I'll answer both. Okay, yeah. it's okay. Yours, um, it hasn't changed anything in no? terms of, not in terms of like, oh, I don't want a baby or anything mm. like that. Just, I don't know. I feel like we're all at a stage now where, if, you know, I feel like everyone is old enough and responsible enough to actually have a kid and look after it. Responsible you know I mean? enough is yeah, yeah. okay, yeah. yeah. Well, with the partner. Yeah, yeah, sure, yeah, exactly. Um, and your question, it doesn't feel like you have a kid. No, no. I, no. I'm, it's way more noticeable that you've just moved. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Not, not in like a, <clears throat> any bad way, just the fact that you've moved away and that's what you, we take away from it. Whereas, course, yeah, yeah. But yeah. when you're at home, you're looking after Harper, but. Yeah, it's true. Well, to be fair, if I was still in London, maybe you'd notice a bit more. Yeah. So I'd be like, I gotta go. I gotta yeah, go. for cool. sure. Thing is, if I'm here, I'm here, right? Like, what can I do? Well, yeah. yeah, and I think ultimately uh, your other responsibilities won't change because you, you know, you need to carry on your life as it was. Yeah, so you yeah. need to keep all the things yeah. that you had, like Ace and everything and this going. Yeah. So, and that's the yeah. way I'm thinking about, because, you know, being a cameraman, I'm still, I'm with you guys all the time. There's a lot of, I have to de de dedicate to it. Yeah. So. I'm there like, oh, am I gonna have to spend, am I gonna feel bad about not spending time with the kid? But. I feel like Ethan has also said this before, but like, I think for our, cause our, what, our, what our jobs are, make it much easier than it, like, yeah. is for everyone else, you know? Which is That's what I do find mad is that, like, you know? the whole thing of I, I wanna be there as much as possible. Yeah, it's understandable, but like, People that work normal jobs. Oh my God, John. I oh know, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm yeah, so I'm sorry. I'm People so that sorry. work like a nine to five. Yeah, yeah. 
see their kid way less. Yeah, yeah, for sure. It's 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 always just you know it's um. Well, so I'm I'm grateful that obviously I do what I do, and also Laura does what she does because of like the business as well. So like she doesn't work nine to five either. So it's been really easy for well, no, it's not, I'm not saying it's easy, but it's like different. You know, more fortunate than a lot of other people out there. So it's like you know, and obviously like of course we can afford to buy everything. So that's nice too. Well, we're also in three stages of owning a house. Yes, that is true. You yes. lived in a house and had a house for ages. Yeah. <laughs> You're I've, getting, you've got a house. I've just got oh, a house in the, in the last month. Yeah, it's all happening. Everything's going congrats, on the congrats. way. Yeah. How is it? You've it's moved great. in now. It's great, yeah. Especially because I, I didn't go from what you guys were, which was living in really nice apartments. I was living at home with my parents. Oh, well, that felt unnecessary. Oh, well, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying. wasn't that good, John. It, yeah, it was. It was really good. It was really nice. Yeah, yeah, it was really nice. Yeah, no, it's, it's fucking great. Cause especially being like in, in your late 20s and then moving out of your parents. I'm just, I, mate, I, I just love sitting in my, what? What, because I'm 30? Is that what you're saying? No, I'm saying because I'm nearly 30. Okay. How old are you? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to be 30 in two months. Wow. I'm 30 ne- the year after this one, next year. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the first time I've actually spoken to John? <laughs> yeah, right. like, yeah. How old are you? Like, <laughs> you're finding out things about it. <laughs> did, did, did you have no idea? Did you, <laughs> have, any idea? Work, did you have any idea how old I was? <laughs> no, nah, I could guess. Of course okay. I could guess. Yeah, because yeah, you'd, yeah. you'd, you'd like answer to, um, what do you call it? Like, you'd, you wouldn't. You thought I was 40. You didn't know how old you were. You thought. He was 40. Well, he acts. It's really awful. That's what You do act 40, <laughs> Nick. You do act 40. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Um, but congrats on the house. I know you had some complications before, right? So oh, mate, great. buying a house is long, like for anyone. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. it think. actually is long. Yeah. It was the, it, I've had like the smoothest sailing uh, <laughs> buying yeah, a house. Yeah. I don't well, want to. Not all of us have 10 million subscribers. You know? <laughs> <laughs> no, we just got really lucky with yeah. like. We... No, actually, no, you didn't know. Because what you happened to yours happened to mine. But you just don't feel it as much. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like he doesn't take stress that hard. Like he just kind of just. You know, well, you know, my house got like devalued right by the bank. Oh yeah, no, no, that side, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 But in terms of like, we viewed the house once. Yeah, yeah. we didn't view any other houses. Yeah, we just went. Oh, this house is amazing. We love it. Yeah, we'll take it. And spoke, and there was no chain or anything. It was done. Yeah, I, I was very lucky as well then. Yeah, and then Talia did like a load of the other stuff though. She had a lot of planning, a lot of ideas about what she yeah. liked. Yeah. Yeah, but to be fair, I would have lived in it as it was. Yeah, I just don't yeah. uh, purely because it was. It's thirty times better now, but I just don't think I would have seen the outside of the. <laughs> we all got mad at me you now because it's like we have like a desk as you walk in to the uh, like hallway. We you put your keys and stuff on, and she's got a desk in the lounge where she like works. And she was like, "Oh man, like, well, she didn't say, oh man.' Yeah. I'm, I'm paraphrasing there. <laughs> she's like, "Hey, um, should we swap the desk around?" <laughs> And I was like, I just don't, I don't care. But not in a bad way. Like, I was, I was like, I don't care. Like, you can do if you want to. Like, just, I'll, I'll, what's like you point? don't want to focus any energy on it. She, yeah, she, she got really bad at me. I was like, it just yeah. doesn't matter. Like, it literally, like, it, it's just, it's just too just dead. I think phrase. it feels nice for to have you involved in the decision making. No, no, no. Phrase don't care. I, I actually didn't say don't care. I, I actually added that. I'm now remembering what I did say. I said, no. Sharp. <laughs> 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 no, I was like, what's the point? <laughs> She's like, oh, this looks better. I'm like, well, I just, I don't, then I said, I don't care. <laughs> Is it weird? Because I feel like for both of you, these are both kind of like forever homes for you. Like, they're no. at least long. They're not? I feel no. like that house is not a forever home. No. Even mine's what? Not, even mine's not John. Come on. What? When are you? When would Tali you? Is we're, like, couple, we're a couple of Moogles over here. Yeah, you are Moogles. Yeah, big time Moogles. <laughs> <laughs> we are Moogles. I think I've lost my Moogle status, to be honest. A little bit. Yeah. 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 Well, no, Talia's dream is to build a house like from scratch. Oh. So we'll stay here for a, a long time, mm, but mm. when we can, like I'll happily go. Yeah. Just next one. Yeah. Are oh, you going to have any hand in designing it when you build my the office house? and football yeah. pitch? Yeah, that's <laughs> nice, that's, nice, that's nice. literally it. You're putting a football pitch in the gut in the house you have now, right? Yeah. Do you reckon that'll be work started today? Oh, oh did, did it? it? Oh, yeah. sick, sick. Got woken up super early by what the builders. Yeah, you cannot complain. You've been waiting for this football pitch forever. I know, but it, basically, we have a gate so they could go round and go straight in, and like four of the cars did. And then one guy came in and was like, "Hi, I'm here for the football pitch." And I was like, uh, "Yeah, it's around there." I was yeah, because I stayed up to watch Love Is Blind. Oh, and didn't yeah. even show. Well, let's just briefly mention this because I, I've been watching the show as we discussed in the previous podcast, yeah. and I got addicted to it. Yeah, I've watched now two and a half seasons. Yeah, I've watched all three. Mad. I've mm. watched the first two episodes of one and the last episode of one. Okay. <laughs> okay. I can get can get boring after it does, a while. Yeah, and yeah, I just want to see the end, that. you know. And then I've seen uh, a bit of two, seven episodes. But anyway, the Love Is Blind it was a re- re- reunion live this time for the first time ever. Is it Netflix's it? first live? <clears throat> no. Oh, okay. I have it, never it, watched an episode just for clarity. I'm, I'm well, basically, yeah. they 
you know the premise of it. We've explained it here before. They get, yeah, they get married. They get, <coughs> married. They get married without seeing yeah, each yeah. other. Uh, well, well yeah. whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. But they were going to do a reunion, which would be, you know, six months, a year, whatever, after the show. And they were live streaming it at 1 a.m. And Because it's Australian, right? Uh, American. No, it's oh, American. it's American, right? It's American, okay. yeah. yeah. Uh, so live stream didn't work. And then they tweeted like, oh, I'll be up in 15 minutes. 15 minutes yeah. later, didn't work. Kept going, kept going, kept going. And it was like, I, we and me and Talia ended up going to sleep. Yeah, I'm glad you did because I was. I felt bad that I kind of like told you to watch it as well. No, no, we wanted to. Yeah, but, like, but also you could watch it like tomorrow, for example. But I was like, it's good to talk about it on the podcast if yeah. we both see it together. But um, yeah, well, Chris Rock did his live show. And his was fine. Okay. But to be fair, Love Is Blind is massive. Yeah, I watched one TikTok and now my whole feed is just Love Is Blind. And I'm, I'm loving it. Loving Netflix it. is like banner. Considering how big Netflix is, yeah. is Love Is Blind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's their main focus. They're doing a UK one, you know. Yeah, no. Oh, can't wait. I am shocked I by the tea there. I am shocked by the amount of these kind of shows that you guys watch because it just seems like you. Well, wouldn't... Well, hold, well, hold on. He doesn't. He doesn't. Now I'm no, in. I'm in. Because now. he's but always. Love, but even like Love Island, because you watch Love well, Island I'll and stuff. Well, if I stop there, I'll stop. But he has slated okay. me for these kind of shows. Yeah, I have in the past. Time. And even even Love Island. There's one season where I remember you we were talking about the start of it, and I had not watched the episode, but I kind of said that I did, and I read the mirror or something like before. To see what the they thought about it, so I can. Ha so my opinion was their opinion. When I talked to him. <laughs> Are you watching it, acknowledging that it's like shit TV? Yes. Well, no, but yeah, hold, on, okay, but hold okay. on, hold on, but it's not shit TV. Okay, it's just like shit people. Oh, sorry. No, oh, no, see, no, that's no, more no, controversial. No, 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 <laughs> he sent me a young Sheldon TikTok the other day. Bro, he had four million likes, man. And like, I was, it, and he was like, "Hey, hey, buddy, thought you would like this." Hey, buddy. <laughs> I actually said, "Hey, buddy." No, nah, just well, did, wait. Did you like it? It wasn't very funny. No, nah. <laughs> but know. I said, I, I said, "Hey, you're the one with young Sheldon TikToks on your oh, true." Bro, I went to America, right, and TikTok wouldn't work for a whole week. I came back and I had to catch up. I, I didn't even know about General G. Seen, I didn't know about General G. They call me the general. Yeah, hopped out of Lambo feeling incredible. I missed that, man. I missed well, speaking of America, how was America? Because you, you know, got back. Yeah, America's different, week. man. I like America. Everyone hates it, right? Um, it. I think it's just security and stuff. Oh, yeah, no. Like, well, no one ever mm, feels safe when we go there. Don't get me wrong, yeah. But the problem, what I realized, though, because obviously I've been, like, with you guys to, you know, LA, New York. Um, What's the other one? Vegas. Yeah, Vegas. Yeah. And it, but, like... The other one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You know what I mean? There's three cities. No, but that's, no, but that's what I'm trying to say. Like we've been to those places on filming trips. Yeah. And obviously we do have fun there. We do like chill, obviously Vegas especially. But like Vegas is not, it's not necessarily America. It's just Vegas, right? That's its mm. own identity. Yeah. It's like Blackpool Treasure, Tre Pleasure Island. You know, it's similar to that, you could say. But yeah. amplified a little bit, right? Like, yeah, yeah, a little bit, yeah. Little bit, little bit, little bit <laughs> shinier. But no, what I'm trying to say is like, they're, they're like the spots, you know, where like New York, New York and LA, they've got their own identity. Whereas like I went, went to Texas and it's like actually like real America, if that makes sense. Maybe like very real, but I, I was like living like a normal life rather than going for like. I've been to Texas. Yeah, yeah, actually, yeah. So is Nick. Well, yeah, I went to see him. Oh, right, okay. He studied there for a year. Did you? What did you study? Astronauts. <laughs> <laughs> why, why? Why did that come? Houston, up? we have a problem. Ameri oh, American okay. studies I mean, in history. Yeah. NASA, yeah, yeah, history yeah. and American studies. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's quite cool. <laughs> American studies, nice. And he's got loads of cool stories about it, but he didn't want to come on the podcast. So uh, oh, next time, yeah. boo. Next time. boo. No, but I understand as well. You know, I hitchhiked to see him. From kind England? Of, kind of. No. No. In Texas. Houston. Basically, our flight was meant to go to... Can I say where it was? Yeah. So we we're going to go College Station. I've been there! Have you? So it was College Station and our flight I, was meant to go have. to Houston or Dallas? Dallas. Dallas. And then you get a, se a separate flight down to there. Uh, and it got cancelled. And they were, I was on my own at this point. And they were like, um, they were like yeah, flight's cancelled. Uh, pff, there's no more flights. Oh my right. God. And I was kind of like, okay, what do I do? So they're like, oh, you can go rent a car. <laughs> oh, too young. I'm too young. Yeah. Can't yeah. do it. So yeah. there's a family that are renting a car and they're like, they literally say, oh, if anyone wants to come with us, by the way, you can. And I'm, I'm literally like, yeah, please. And someone else jumps in front of me, <laughs> takes it. So then there's this businesswoman. Oh. And she's, uh, she literally sees me kind of put my hand up and she's like, oh, I'm, I'm going if you want. Mm -hmm. So I get this like, six hour drive or something Jeez. with this random woman Jeez. that I've never met. Businesswoman. Did you talk together? Or are you just like sat in the back? No, I sat, <laughs> sat in the back. <laughs> she was <laughs> like, I'm not paying for it. My business is so you can come if you want. I'm paying for it? What do you mean by that? As in her business paid for the car. So I didn't have to pay for it or anything. Oh, well, why would you have to pay anyway? Because I'm getting a six hour journey. Yeah. She's going there anyway, right? Yeah, but we could have shared. I thought hitchhiking was free. Well, yeah, but I didn't do this on the side of the road. You should have. 
I should have. No, 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 no. But I got in the car and she's like, oh, do you mind if I put my music on? Death metal. <laughs> Six hours. But no talking. Uh, no, nah, we talked a little bit. About death metal? Um, no. Was it any point awkward? <laughs> anyone, anyone? The whole thing. Oh, the whole yeah, thing was yeah, awkward. Yeah. I would have, ha I would have hated it. I'm not a very sociable person with people yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, same, actually, yeah. I can feel yeah, that. So yeah, six hours of death yeah. metal and all But like so bad that you would never do it again? Um, Not, I wouldn't choose to do it again, mm. but you know, it, it, was, it was a fun experience, I guess. You'd do it for a Sidemen video? Um, uh, maybe not. Speaking of Sidemen videos. Yep, nice. Well, well, no, I actually was going to say something first. Oh, okay. go on, then, go on. Then. Um, if I look really tired, because I've slept ten hours in about four days. Well, now everyone's going to look at if you're tired, bro. I'm so tired. But no one should be surprised who listens to the podcast a lot, though, because you, you turn up like this all the time. You are always tired. You always. I do live four hours away. <laughs> yeah, that is. Yeah, that is. That's <laughs> fair. True. That is fair. <laughs> because that's right, fair. listen, man. Um, so like, my flight was delayed. No, yep. they, they changed my flight to a sh like a really bad one. Like I had to change in Charlotte. Oh well, no! No, nah, oh, like, I, I don't know. I, I don't know why. I hate. Change of flights, and this is like Dubai for a day, you know. Then I'm like, okay, I'll go and have fun. It's an inconvenience with, with General G. <laughs> <laughs> um, but now, so my flight was delayed, and then uh, we had an among us that I was gonna miss because I was delayed, but I made it. Yeah, and I rushed here. Then I went to go and do something. Can I say what I went to do? Yeah, I went to do a fitting for Sam's wedding. How cool <laughs> is that? Ooh. Went and did that, but I was knackered. Got I was home. A tutu. I was wearing a tutu. I will be. Wait, doing. was this a groomsman's fitting? Uh, yeah. Ah. Oh, yeah. Nice. <laughs> Nice. Are yeah. you gonna? Can, can you, are you gonna say who you? Who you no. Guys? No. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's not do that. <laughs> no, John. Um, yeah. Anyway, no, I'm trying to say. And then my whole week was like off. So I went um, on. And on Friday, there's a Pokemon tournament. Internationals. You know the worlds? They did it internationals at the same place. XL. 8 a.m. I had like a pro private. They did, they did, with like influencers they did like a private walk through the Pokemon Center. So I was like to bang a video to get all the like merch first. You know. So I went and did that. But I was like, I can't stay the whole weekend because I'm just knackered. So my weird brain decided to that I would set off at 4 a.m. to get there for 8 a.m., do the walk around and just didn't leave. So I literally drove four hours to just do like a half an hour filming and then go, go home. But then I, I couldn't sleep because of that jet lag, I guess, the day before, so I just didn't sleep. So I didn't sleep until 4 a.m. and drove, came back and slept. And then on Saturday, for some reason, I did like a 12 hour stream. Then I had three hours that night and then I went to help Laura at the unit because of my parents being away. And then last night, Love is Blind happened. <laughs> you know, have you, have you tried happen. sleeping? No. No, you haven't. See, I mean, I had, in all of this, I, had, I think the only thing hours, missing is you sleeping. I had two hours this, this morning. Two hours. You've only had two hours today. Yeah. Just, don't blame me. Blame Love is Blind. That's true. And yeah. was was it worth it though? Was Not it, really. It didn't no. even show. Oh, well, oh, you waited up for it. For, oh, right. Well, I watched it on TikTok Live. So the end of the Love is Blind story yeah. is they tweeted, Sorry. didn't work. We're going to go record it and it will be on Netflix as soon as possible. Great. Yeah. But it worked for Dope. some people. So I was watching it on someone in America's, uh, they put their phone up onto the TV on TikTok Live and the dog was walking around and they kept laughing. I was like, bro, can you stop laughing? I'm like you, you're showing, like, you just kept talking and commenting. She's like, oh my God, I can't believe you said that. I'm like, no, shut up. For reference, what was the best part of it? Oh, oh, oh spoilers. Oh yeah, yeah, shit. Yeah. Spoilers. yeah, okay, fine. By the way, I have the best TV show for you to watch. Is it Young Sheldon? It's, it's not. It's, uh, it's, it's shit. Oh. Shit TV. Oh, oh okay. Oh, well, it's what's, called, what's um, fuck, what's it called? It's a Channel 4 show. Paddy McGuinness hosts it. Oh no, it's that's like, already great. Yeah, it's called like Avoid Temptation or something like that. Oh, is it? Is oh, yeah. It's so good. Wait, Basically, what's the premise? It's twelve random people put together, and they have to do a eighteen day hike. Oh, uh, I've heard South, this. South yeah. Africa. <laughs> oh, okay. And of, along the way, they they share three hundred thousand pounds at the end if they make it. If they make it, okay. Um. Do, wait, do all 18 people have to make it? 12 people. 12, oh, 12, 12 people, 18 days. Okay, do all 12 have to uh, make it? If though? they quit, they lose £25,000. Okay. But along the way, they get tempted with stuff, like oh, home but, but before, stuff. Before, they only have like rice and like beans to eat, right? Well, yeah, yeah. So oh, they, sorry, they, sorry. Um, they get tempted with stuff like a nice bed, mm. something like that. And the prices are outrageous. Uh, but some of the people are way more like, oh, I'm here for an experience. Some of them are yeah. like, we, may, we need to save this money. Uh, and they get fed like a thousand calories a day, which is just rice and beans, mm -hmm. kidney beans, and that's mm -hmm. it. Yep. And they have a camp, they have to bring their own water and stuff like that. And then they'll randomly walk across a diner and it'll be like, all right, 400 pounds for a milkshake. That's what I was thinking, yeah, okay. But the 400 pounds comes out of everyone. Everyone, yeah, yeah. So like I could say, yeah, I'll sleep in a bed tonight that's three grand. I'm only paying 300 pounds, but you're paying 300 pounds, you're paying 300 pounds. And it's amazing. Who out of the troops do you think would be the worst on that show? Because I think it's JJ straight off the bat. Uh, 
Yes. It'd be JJ or Ethan. Ethan would enjoy the hike. Yeah. But the other people and the fact that they are spending his money mm. would piss him off. Oh, and he'd then he'd spend money. Yeah. Yeah. I would either be very petty and as soon as I see someone else spending my money, I'd just spend all of it. Mm-hmm. Or I'd be completely fine. And I'd just be like, look, just have a fun time, you know. Mm. Depends on the mood. How do you reckon you'd fare, Andy? I would be awful. I would take, <laughs> I would take the car. I would take whatever they give me. I would take it. Yes, yeah, so they'll literally be like, oh, you can take a shortcut today. Yeah, definitely. For two grand per person. I tell you what, this doesn't sound like shit TV though, because it sounds more engaging. Is it that, oh, that, it's again, amazing. That the, is it again that the people are a bit... Yeah. Yeah, they're not nice or something. Um, well, I mean, the we'll people see. make we'll the give them a chance. The people definitely make the show. Yeah, the people make the show, yeah. But like, it, it's, it's so good. It's only six episodes. Yeah. But it's amazing. Okay, if anyone wants to watch it. Yeah. Yeah. Did you know they've aligned, just to go back to that? Um, they they make them wait a year. For the reunion? No, no, no. Oh. They make them, they, they, you, you apply and it takes a year, apparently. Really? Well, they, someone said on the show, it can take a year for me to get into it. Mad. To start filming. But they tell them, don't put your life on hold. But obviously they're gonna. Yeah. If you know you're gonna be on Love is Blind, you're gonna be like, imagine that, imagine you like, imagine you stop real connections to go on Love is Blind just to get into a toxic relationship on that. People are weird, man. Yeah. Yeah, well, they'll probably give you a year to actually like decide if you want to marry someone on the first time of meeting them because it's a pretty big decision you should no, no, think no. about. You, you, get, you get like four days. Well, you talk to them in a pod without seeing them for like five Oh, no, days. I mean just the act of marrying a random person on one day. Like you should have a year to think about doing oh, that. Oh, That's yeah, what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, spend, you spend like two, three weeks with them or something like that okay, yeah. before you marry them, hmm. stuff like that. Yeah. I was going on to that because you were saying like the people make the show. And I feel like yeah. this, this is what is always true with like reality shows, dating yeah, shows, right? So even Love Island, like depending on the cast, it yeah. can really make yeah. or break it. Well, speaking of- oh, Sidemen. Sidemen. Yeah. Uh, mm. <laughs> we had the Hot V Cold camping. You did both trips? I did both trips. Wow, John. I, I know, thanks. How was Appreciate it possible? Oh, uh, I know. Yeah, I mean, At the same time. The, the PJ back and forth constantly. Wow. Yeah. Like, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, clearly they weren't filmed at the same time. They were not. Yeah. Oh, right. It makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was all about, because our schedule's so busy. So busy, man. We also, I don't feel like the videos, like the narrative now, it's not important if they're at the same time. Sometimes it feels better. Mm, mm, I think the video I loses disagree. a lot. Yeah. You do. You do. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Yeah. I think the video loses a lot. I think this video is still good, but I think it loses a lot when we aren't able to like speak to each other and we know how their trip's going compared to ours yeah. and stuff like that. Also, our side was very dull. I will say, I've watched 18 minutes because I was watching it while Louis Blind was not working and I fell asleep. Um, not because of this. It's fine. <laughs> but I was skipping through my phone and literally I, I didn't know you guys were in it. Because no, when I skip, it didn't do it. Just go in this video and just click random places. Oh, never mind. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <that's laughs> yeah, he did say the first 18 minutes, to be fair. <laughs> no, I, I just skipped through it all as well. But I'm, like, it just, the white team, well, sorry, the snow team. <laughs> <laughs> the white. <laughs> no, yeah. Sorry, guys, I meant the snow team. Um, seems to be in it well, a lot more. Yeah, it's because our side was meant to be like this really nice camping, which it was, but we had this other area where there was like sandboarding, uh, football, volleyball, archery. Which could have been good. It would have been good, but there was a bunch of kids that yeah. literally like, they're all doing the archery. Yeah. So we go, all right, right we'll man. go sandboard. Yeah. We go over to sandboard. Second we put the board on, a bunch of people oh. run over and Oh just yeah, like, not, we're not, doing not that kids now. at this point who don't know any better. It was oh, adults, wow. it was oh. rude adults and their yeah. children. They were rude. Yeah, oh, they were so rude. It was a bunch of people rude. that were basically Finish never heard, no. Dude, they picked up the bow and arrow and literally like there was a kid, it's the second they picked it up, came over and the mum went, go on, then go on there. The mum, the mum went, let her go. And we went, oh, we've literally just started. We're, go- we're just gonna like, film. we're just gonna film something super quick. And she goes, you have five minutes. <laughs> she was also shocked though that, that they would even say yeah. that to her. She was completely like, oh, yeah. wow. what's happening? Yeah. yeah, she couldn't perceive that it could happen. Damn, yeah. And damn. we went over and said to the guy doing the sandboarding, we were like, oh, can we like, can we have a go? And he was like, yeah, sure. Um, and then he was teaching us like, you know, okay, do this, do this, do this. And then I think it was probably the same group of women just yeah. walked over, put the sandboard on, and started going down the hill, and he's like, "No, no, no! You can't just, you can't just go." Mm-hmm. And had to leave us, and was like, "I'm so sorry, but they're." Oh yeah, he looked helpless. He, he clearly felt yeah. bad, but he, and he felt so bad no that we had to basically just wait for another like hour. Mad, mad. Yeah. So yours, but the thing was, that I don't think the hot ca- the hot camping was really as much of an experience as the other one. The other one no, was like, wasn't. I think I think because there's there's an element of like struggle in the cold one. That's why the, the other one feels so much more. I'm gonna use the word calm and not dull. I mean the cold holiday team has always been an experience. Mm. Mm. Whereas like 
like this one, I felt like ours was ours was amazing, but kind of boring. Like you would love it as a nice experience, but for a video, it's not great. Yeah. Oh, that's the that's hot v cold. You remember the hot v cold team where we went Dubai mm -hmm. and they went to Iceland, I think. Yeah, a long time. It was yeah. 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 The Dubai one was an amazing time, but again, not great for a video. It wasn't like. Well, because the thing is, like, I feel like in life. There's not really that many places on the earth that are like, okay, hold on, as hot as you can get cold compared to what our normal life is. Does that make sense? Y yes. So yeah, like, okay, so we're in England, right? We can yeah. go to Dubai, maybe like Arizona or something is probably the hottest compared, right? Mm -hmm. so the hottest place we, we could go, Austra right? Y yeah, Australia, right, yes. Whereas yeah, like you can go Estonia in the winter, which is like, oh, or wherever you guys went here, which is like, that's extreme cold. There's not a ton you can do in the heat either. The only thing people really do in the heat is go inside to where it's cold. In the cold, you can put on stuff that allows you to be outside. But when it's hot, what are you going to do? Just so everyone walking around with fans. Like, it's not... Yeah. You can't do it. No, I'm, I'm saying cold. I'm saying the cold places are colder than the hot places are hot. Yeah, yeah I'm getting... Like, I agree with that. You're just wearing t-shirts. Like, what, what's, what's mm. like, hot about that? What, what, yeah, true. You, like, looking for it, it wasn't actually that hot. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. It was in a desert. Okay. Well, yeah, it actually wasn't that hot. No. Yeah, yeah you didn't, <laughs> you didn't, you're not struggling. You're just, like, enjoying life. Yeah. Yeah. See, I was thinking... the boys are like, look at this. Yeah. Because I saw a few comments that kind of spoke to this. That one was like, "Hey, in the future, I don't know if we want to see as much of stuff like the um, like the hot team." And I was thinking, what about if you did something like island camping versus jungle camping? Because then you've got the experiences like kind of someone could set it up in the same way that the ice one was set up. You know what I mean? Yeah. Ooh, for free? Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Is it you? Yeah. That's blurred. Uh, basically, we were sandboarding, and I went down once. Oh crap! And then Josh went oh, the other my God, way. Oh, even hurt. It's not bad. It's, it wasn't bad. <laughs> but Josh went down it and then Josh was like, I'm going to try going down the other way around. Yeah. And then I was like, oh yeah, give it a go. He fell over straight away. And I was like, okay, that's not Josh. a good idea. He went, no, you said you were going to do it. So uh, do it. So I did it. Fell immediately. Snapped the thing and like cut my toe open. Could you see Josh a little bit. And you busted your lip, and you busted your lip as well at the same time. I did, yeah. Yeah, bit of a shit time for you. Yeah. And that was when the sun was setting. So everyone else went over and, you know, got some nice pictures in front of the sun setting. And I was sat there getting, uh, is this where I fall? CPR on your toe. Yeah, going that way down was not great. Yeah, this is it. So I went there. It's, it, was literally, was it. it wasn't bad. <laughs> it's, yeah. I hope you're okay. Bro, I don't even, I literally, I didn't know it happened until yeah, I looked down and there's a bunch of blood. Yeah, yeah. that was probably the crazy, no, still craziest there. thing that happened for their team. To that was it. <laughs> <laughs> the craziest thing. <laughs> that was it. Wasn't this some sort of fire-like show? Oh yeah, but yeah, that wasn't them. That was, that was something. Oh, right. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, it was okay. It just... It was a nice time. It was very wholesome at the end of the night. Where was, was this? Um, this Dubai. Oh, right. Yeah. Sick. In Dubai desert. desert. Got you, got you. Yeah. Quite far was... out as well. Yeah. Like, I think they had 100 kilometers of, like, squared for this whole reserve oh, wow. that this place was on. Yeah. I mean, it was fun. It just wasn't... I don't think it was amazing for a video. Yeah. Well, now in retrospect, what would you have rather been on? Would you still rather have been on the hot team or would you have liked to do it? It's the cold always uh, if you offer it to me tomorrow, I'm going to take the hot team. Oh, really? Because okay. it's always like, it's just com it's comfortable. Yeah. It's easy. Whereas if you <laughs> ask me, oh, which experience would I rather have in my head? Yeah. The cold one. Yeah. Because that's actually like life affirming, I think. It's like I like being cold. Say. I like wrapping up. Yeah. You know, would I you like, like what, what, what I would, would you have liked? I've chose the, the cold team. Yeah. Yeah. But I know, like, yeah, I know afterwards I'd much have preferred to be on that team. Mm. But right now, the thought of doing it is, I just don't want to. I think we just need to give a shout out to the guys who, the fixers that we have in Iceland who sort out all the cold stuff or most of the cold videos. They're just sick though, as well. So I don't really know if we've got yeah. that set up in Dubai to have things like that organized. Because these guys, every step of the way, they, they, they do this for fun. Like yeah. they, Same guys they, before as well, right? Yeah, same guys okay. as before. I think we've used them three times. We used them in the Lapland video as well. Mm. Well, mm. this is JJ, like me, JJ and Toby did the, we were on the Sweden team, which was cold, mm. but yeah. it wasn't, it wasn't like this. Yeah. You know, we it was snowy, but it wasn't, um, you know, like building an igloo. <laughs> this was JJ's first time on the cold team. Oh. I've still never done it. Mad. But, he literally put in the chat like, yo, this has actually been life changing. I yeah, like, this yeah. Is, sick, sick. This is nuts. Yeah, I was still, I kept asking him questions about that at different intervals. I was like, what do you think about it now? And he's like, yeah, yeah. he loved it. Mm -hmm. And it's also the second was... time I watched him shit and filmed him shit. Oh, so wow. that's great. Wow. Seen him piss on people now and yeah. shit twice. Yeah. So yeah, it's not in the video. Oh, oh. yeah. <laughs> I mean, maybe he didn't then. <laughs> um, yeah, Sidemen are back. I was gonna ask like, how, how did you do out of 10? Cause you, you know, uh, yeah, big, big old, big old 10, oh. <laughs> big old stinky 10. But I think, I think the channel needs momentum. 
Yeah, of course. Yeah. Well, right. so, that's, that's true on every channel. And you guys have never missed a, day, a week, right? Yeah. So, so give it a couple, like, give it a couple weeks. Yeah. And I think everything will start picking back up again. Yeah. 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 Um, I believe you prepared a a quiz or questions. Well, there, there are there are there are some questions that I have because uh, well, and there's also a challenge. I don't know if you've seen that at any point on there, but um, the top. Yeah, there's there's a, a guy who broke the world record for drinking Capri Suns as quick as quick as possible in ten seconds. I'm in the one that's above right, it. Captions behind him. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, so there's Capri Suns here. If you guys wanted to give that a go, ten point. I can do. I can do that. That's what I'm saying. I saw ten, ten seconds. Oh, ten seconds. I think that's pretty reasonable. Oh, oh shit! Oh, impossible. Okay, you know you don't think you think he's no. A, is he drinking the straw? Well, sorry, I don't mean that. Is he drinking with the straw? Yeah. Hmm. hmm. A deep throat in it. You scared me though. Why? Because you found a slug in a Capri Sun. Yeah, but I'm sure what? these haven't got slugs. I've thought like four times on the podcast. I won't. He literally yeah. he drank it and he felt something weird and That's it was a slug. Disgusting. Yeah, yeah. we complained yeah. and they said. Not looking at me. But that wasn't quiz. actually what I was talking about. I was talking about the other thing you had written. Yes, the quiz is from a game called Let's Get Deep, and okay. it's based around uh, couples. And so I want to see how basically, you know, if you guys would know what each other's answers are. Let me go through and... So we're a couple. Yeah, yeah, you're, yeah, a, yeah, you're, yeah. A, you're the couple in this instance. Oh, thank oh. you. Um, you just for a finger there as well. I like that. <laughs> um, <laughs> double double oh, touch. Oh. Before you get into this. Go on. I just want to say, like, we had a fire alarm before the podcast started. I think mm. that's why I'm so off. You know what I'm saying? It just feels off. Do the quiz. No, no, no. <laughs> also, also. Randy, it's because I'm here. It's because that's no, it's what not, it is. No, it's not. But then also, just for those who don't know, John is like the cameraman for Sidemen as well. Oh, you did an intro for him. We did literally speak about Roughly how he's, so. the, he's the he's the most involved with the side men. Okay, well I got he some, does side men. He does more side men. Well, I got some questions. After the quiz, I got some questions for you. Okay, okay, okay. As I guessed. Right. Um, I'm going to ask these questions, and then I want you to how we're we going to uh, do the caption thing or not as well, though. We can do that at some point. We can see uh, today. Do, today. Yeah, we want to see how well you know each other as a couple. Right. right? Let's assess it. Can I chill out, it? man. Can I have one? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah you can have one. Yeah. Yeah. Can I have one now. Yes, you how many do we have? Yeah, we got four. It's a small box. Four. There's only four in there. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Just do the thing. Do the do the ten You sort yourself out. I'll do the quiz. No, no, do the ten seconds. Just no, do it now. Do it now. He's not going to. He's not going to sit still. Oh, true, 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 true. Do it there. What? Oh, what we got at the same time. Well, I didn't know you could get a four pack. I thought you did like a all right. 12 pack. We're okay. all doing it at the That's same time. Favorite, so we can't take the straw off yet. It's orange, guys. I can't do it. Okay. What do you mean it's Paper straw? He's got a he's, uh, straw down? He has got a plastic straw. It's orange. That's not fair. I don't think that changes it. So hang on. It is, ripping it, is, it, is it ripping it off the pack as well? Yeah, yeah. It's ripping off. Okay. I don't think you have to. Need... Okay. As in, I was just going to go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I did that this morning. All right. Give us a three, two, one. Three, two, one. Good. Oh, shit. Fuck! No, I'm out. Empty mouth after. <sighs> you spilt What yeah. the hell? Yeah. <laughs> That's the worst effort I've ever seen. I Why did you I squeeze thought, it? Because I thought squeezing it would push to force it out through there, not make a bigger hole. Okay. I reckon yeah. I can beat 10 seconds, by the way. Can I go again? You got 14 seconds. Yeah, you were 14. I was looking. I actually didn't finish mine. That yeah, was what? That wasn't, I, I, that I wasn't nice. I basically did, but like... Nick, give me again. I can, I can, I can this is the last chance. Yeah. Okay, hold on. You also started Come early, around by the way. I, I did. Heard, I, I did heard start you start early. very early. Three, two... On go, on go. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Go on, Randy. Fuck! That's actually good technique. I think he's fucked it already. Yeah. Four, eight, nine, ten. Now he's done it. He's done. It's a valiant effort, though. 14 seconds. I mean, 15 seconds. I didn't finish it either. I'd like to see it with the plastic straw, so I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. I, I think don't think it would make much of a difference. I reckon if I could insert it quicker. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> All right. You know now that you failed the challenge. Yeah. Yeah, but I beat you guys. Can we do that quiz? Yeah, yeah, of course. You, of course. you actually disqual were disqualified from the first race. <laughs> yeah. If this was 100 metres, you'd, you'd be out. I'm still happy with my performance. If it was 100 metres, I wouldn't even get on. I wouldn't even be able to, like, balance the start. You know, you do legs up, you know. Three, two, one, go. Go we're on, proud of you. We're proud, on, of you. We're, we're, we're proud of you. Save him. Nice shoes, by the way. I'm not wearing any today. And, and you. Thanks, and nice man. Jacket. Nice, nice jacket. Thanks, man. You, you, uh, by you... the way, can I just say, this is the best hoodie that any YouTuber's ever made. Have you had one? Have you got a shirt? I've got one, it's but sick. I haven't worn it yet. I love it. Shout out to Freezy and, and Chip. The best one ever. It's very mm. comfortable. Because the childish ones are also. <sighs> oh, I haven't worn this one, so I'm not going to. I love childish too. I've, I've got an idea for what's good, by the way. I'll show you later. Okay. Okay. Okay, bro, can we get here these questions? Yeah, let's well, just... you ask it, man. Yeah, yeah, but you, you just keep talking him. every three seconds. You're right, anyway, so the way I want to carry on. this out is I'm yeah, going to ask yeah. questions. I want you to assess how well the other person answered them, right? So you guys are going to judge if they know you well. Okay. okay. Right. This is a question. So imagine Randy's asking this to Simon. 
How do you think I handle myself when I'm in a crisis situation? So that's to about the other one. So how does Randy ha- handle yeah. himself in a crisis? Yeah, and then you're going to assess what he thinks. Uh, I think Randolph in a crisis. If it's... Oh. We're still drinking crap <laughs> <laughs> How do you have any left? <laughs> yeah. Randy in a crisis, depending on what it is, I think if it's if it's a... Oh, I really don't. I don't know. I've never really seen you in much of a crisis. Do you think he'll be no, like no. overwhelmed or do you reckon he'll take a hand with it? That's, that's, that's no, the two he directions. won't get overwhelmed. He'll get, he'll get pissed off. There'll definitely be some anger. Um, but I don't think, I think he'll stay calm enough to actually deal with it. It will just be more annoyed at whatever the factor is. All right. And before we get around to see how accurate that is, what do you think about Simon oh, in a crisis sure. situation? I think he'd be all right, actually. You think he'd be chill? Yeah, I actually think he would. Yeah. What, yeah. What, what do you think about his assessment of you? Pretty good. Not bad. I think that, well, I would get definitely angry, but I wouldn't like, I, I don't panic usually because I, I don't expect anything of myself anyway. I didn't say you'd panic. No, no, I'm, that's what I'm saying. You, you're yeah. correct, you know, yeah. but I would overthink it all the time. I talk about it nonstop, but I wouldn't actually care. I would. Okay. What about his assessment of you? And he said, I'm chill, is not it? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't really, yeah. uh, uh, what, what, kind, what kind of crisis? Um, like, ooh, like, uh, uh, actually, well, a real crisis would be like some, like, like, like the building is on fire. Oh yeah, well, let's, yeah. Well, go on, you were very calm. Yeah, you actually almost didn't go out. Quite <laughs> <laughs> too calm, actually. Maybe complacent. I'm chill. Maybe, chill, maybe yeah. complacent. So you- yeah, that is very complacent. Yeah, true. Yeah. Um, what are um, f- free strengths that you see between us, you two, um, that you possess as a team? What makes you a good team? What are your strengths? Um, three strengths. First one is willing to put time aside. Oh, that's really to nice. Complete a shared goal. Oh, it's a good strength. One more subs, and then we'll quit. <laughs> <laughs> naked, <laughs> quit naked. We'll quit naked. <laughs> uh, we'll quit being yeah. naked, so we'll be clothed. Yeah. No, I think me and you both, we, we will always like, um, we'll make time for stuff that, oh. considering how busy we can be. I'm not busy, but the yeah, fact yeah. That, yeah. But the fact that we've posted a podcast every week. True. That's actually mad, by the way. Yeah. Because like, we're not the type of people to do that. Your side men can't even do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, true, <laughs> true. Yeah. Um, other strengths. This is both of us, by the way, we can answer. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you can both <laughs> answer. Oh, no, I, I think we also, free. we're on the same wavelength in terms of like how... <laughs> I'm just like, yeah, he's right, he's right, he's right. <laughs> now, we're on, same, up. we're on the same wavelength in terms of like content, I think. We're, we're just kind of yeah. the same way, you know. Also, you're better than, than I am, but I'm, I'm here for the journey as well. Um, and and also... Hmm. Hmm. That's what I was going to say as well. <laughs> Isn't that you, same you, wavelength. Like, you guys are funny, you have interesting things to say, no, any of that? No, no, no. no, no. We also, I think we do look, we actually like a good gossip, you know. We do love a good gossip. Yeah. So I, I think that's not really a strength. Uh, I think it is. <laughs> We've got podcasts. I think I think we both have different strengths that help each other as well. True, true. Like stuff with the podcast, for example. Yeah. You'll sort one thing and I'll like I'll do this, you do that kind of thing. Yeah. yeah. yeah no. I feel like you're more structured and you're more chaos. I yeah. think that's yeah. 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 which works yeah. together. Yeah. yeah. I, I like being I like being chaotic. Yeah. yeah. Like when we when we have a guest on that we don't really know what to talk about, I'll normally try and lead it down this and then you'll go off on some random tangent. Yeah. And it, yeah, kind yeah. Of, it works. It's just time to think about the next one. Yeah. 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 But um, today it's going downhill because John's just yeah, nice. just fucking the vibe. <laughs> Bro, um, you're fucking it out. Yeah, yeah. Right now, I'm just, by the way, guys, I'm just joking. I'm actually really enjoying this. How do you guys think you could add more value to your quality time? <laughs> what with each other? Yeah, nah, it's already quality. Enough. These again, these are no, couples no, what, questions. Okay, what I will say is we like, but this is a this is not just us. This is like our group. Is that we don't actually like we don't hang out. Yeah, but that's because we hang out all the time working. We do. Tri- tri- yeah, but everyone nice. is so everyone is so quick to leave. Yeah, yeah, they are. I was about to say, are. are you engaged when you are spending time together? Though? Oh, we're actually not engaged, but no, you know, you are know I mean, like, engaged with could, could be. No, we are, we are for sure. Like the last, especially the last meal, we all go out and stuff. Yeah, I think I think everyone is, as I said, everyone is always quick to leave. I think, like in the troops, I would say, me, you, Josh. Mm-hmm. Sometimes, uh, freezing lux as well. Freezing lux like, It's committed. always a, a case of like, oh yeah, I'll be there. Like, I'll be there till the end. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah, for sure, for sure. It's not a case of, oh, like, oh I, need, I need to get home. Yeah. Some people just dip real quick, which is also fair enough as it's well. It's fair, yeah. Yeah, but, I mean, like, we obviously would hang out a lot more back at the house. That's because like, that's just where we live. Well, yeah. I, I didn't live there, but when I stayed there. I, I think that's there. literally it, just hang out more. 
Yeah, yeah. But also like, yeah. But I think if we didn't do all work, we would hang out. We'd hang out there, right? Right. I don't know. No, I mean me and you. Oh yeah. We would. Yeah. Right. Yeah, we just live far apart. <laughs> yeah, we do. We do. Yeah. I'll round off on this question. What? I was. I was. Uh, pr- you were most proudest of the other one when? Why is my name? Yeah, you said so, I did. It wasn't. Oh, English. I know. I'll, I'll, I'll round off on this. Oh, one. Okay. oh it does sound like round off. I was like, oh, like, I'll round off. I was wondering this. why everyone was like, "What?" I was like, <laughs> what was the question yeah. again? What are you yeah. most proud of the other person? Yeah, pr- what, when, when, when were you most proud of? Oh my god! Um, like, what was the thing they well, did? Well, he'll say for me with my shows, which is fine. But for you, I was going to say your child. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you know what though? You, you know what? I, <laughs> as an actual like self. <laughs> Pride, yeah, proudness. Yep. Uh, I probably would say a show. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, I mean, listen, man, half us are cool in that, but like, has she, <laughs> she ain't selling out. The <laughs> yeah. She hasn't performed. For you know what? It's not people. your show. It's not your show, though. No, no. It's, oh, um, you mind? You more proud about my ones? That's quite no. cute. Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> what, what, what are you he's, trying to say? Real. I'm saying it, it's not your show that I'm more proud of you for. Oh, okay, I okay, would okay, say. Sorry, sorry. I'd say it's seeing you go out. Uh, Reading. That was sick though, wasn't it? Yeah. Even, even I was like proud of myself. Yeah. Cause everyone I think like, it's cause you've like, you've been to like with Laura so long, you, you're married, having a kid was, I am very proud of you for it, but it's also- Expected, right? Yeah. Yeah. Not in, I, like, I, I don't, well, don't want to take away the achievement. No, 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 no you can do it. It's like, well, well done guys, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't see that one coming. <laughs> Whoa. But- No, yeah, I know. Doing, and then doing your shows, again, very proud, but I think you doing the Reading show is like, you hadn't done music that much no, in that yeah, time. Yeah, and then you just sick. went and did a show in front of what, 60, 70, 80,000 people. Yeah, I'd say more like 80. Didn't it? Yeah, we can, I actually okay. didn't think it was 80, but they, they said it was, but I don't think it was, but I say it is because they said it is. <laughs> but no, that was, that was sick. I'd say for him, he's just like posting. I can't believe how much you post. <laughs> That was that was that was that was a, a very different, a very different answer. Yeah, but he's just going for you know, like you know, when you're at school, man. He's trying to hit the word count, <laughs> <laughs> trying to get extra marks from the teacher, man. Uh, okay, I would say that he's very, very committed when he posts his content, and he has been since the start. Mm. And didn't, like, obviously, he's probably missed days, but like, like not really. Would you yeah. say that Simon motivates you? He does motivate me. Yeah, yes, you, yes, you do. By the way, uh, honestly, because I would think like, say, if I was closer to anyone else in the group, I wouldn't, I wouldn't work as hard as I do, and I don't work that hard at all. <laughs> you know, <laughs> so. <laughs> you know, yeah, you make me want to be better. Oh, you know? well, let's get deep. But, but actually, sometimes I try and like aim too high though, because I try and like I try and emulate what you do, and you do too, too much. Like I'm like, bro, maybe I should do one channel. You know, don't you think it's good though aiming high though? No, no, yeah, because if you aim for the stars, you reach. The there moon. we go. Yeah. <laughs> Is that the phrase? Something I, like that. It's, aim yeah. for the stars, you'll reach the moon. Yeah, you might reach the moon. Though. Like yeah, on the journey, if you're trying hard. No, it's yeah. Oh yeah, but the stars are further than the, but the stars are further, but the stars are further than the moon. Google it, Nick. You got the- no, because the stars are technically just in space, and <laughs> before the moon, you go through space. So it's aim for the moon, and if you shoot fall- for the stars, aim for the moon. No way, that's an album. <laughs> <laughs> it's aim for the moon, and if you miss, you'll yeah. Nick, you're so crap at googling. You put aim for the moon safe. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Nick. If you miss your land among the stars. Did that say okay, that? well, that's shit oh. then. Because it should be, you know, aim, the, you should, aim for the stars, reach yeah, the moon. Yeah, because no, yeah. the stars are within <laughs> the space area. <laughs> yeah, but, but there are, the moon is closer to the earth than any of the stars, even the sun. Like, okay, so if you aim at the moon, right? Say yeah. you launch yourself at the moon. Mm-hmm. That's your goal. Yeah. You miss. Yeah. You would float on towards the stars. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I get it now. Yeah, I get that. I get, it. I get it both ways around though. Either way, you're gonna die because there's no, there's no yeah. oxygen. Yeah, yeah, you'd and, explode. And, yeah. Is there aim for the moon and you'll die. <laughs> 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 you'll die. That's good. Yeah. Well, thanks for that. You were very nice to me then. Appreciate right. that. Thanks. Sorry, I couldn't really emulate you it back. You too. Yeah. You're meant to be the guest. Oh yeah. Oh, so right, right, John. Yeah. Welcome to the podcast. <laughs> Hi. Um, so you're, you obviously you've you know been working for the Simon for a long time now. Coming up on four years. You met them through Con, right? I did. So Con was like, I got this guy, a really hard worker, wants N- to film. Yeah, no, he's loser. Yeah, yeah. I was really nice. No. Yeah, I, he just basically offered me to be a bag boy, and I was like, I'm not really doing much. So that's bag cool. boy. Yeah, I didn't even really know who you guys were. I'm, I think, like, if they I was, think back to it, honestly, seriously, <laughs> I had, like that. I wasn't doing it. I, I thought we were going to be doing like more music video stuff. I didn't really know what he was up to. Um, but I think I, I think I'd probably seen JJ there and thereabouts. Classic, classic. I think uh, I yeah, think yeah. Um, the first video I was actually on was the first Tinder, which okay. is funny because that's like a, a marker of 
I mean, things were already like that, but I feel like the Tinder kind of amplified that. Which Tinder? The first Tinder. Oh. Okay. The very first Tinder. Okay. Um, but yeah, since then, so it's been four years, so now I do What's Good With You Guys, and I do camera work for this, and now you guys have got me doing topics, which is great. And then we do uh, Side Plus, and then we do Simon's channel. When which Simon, doesn't exist. When Simon wants to post, <laughs> whenever, whenever that is. I just, I just can't be bothered right now. It's yeah, so I bad. Yeah, I that. I am the same with main channel. Yeah. Channel, honestly, I would say my like half my stress in life comes from like trying to do main channel. But it's because it's because the videos I'm thinking like I want to do this video for Toby buying thirty presents for thirty mm. and turning thirty because he did it for me and we've done it for a few years. But it's also just like I don't think I'd watch that video. That's bro. This is what I'm getting at now. Like it, it, people, people are taking the level too high. Yeah, they need to slow down, man. Like what the fuck? But I don't even like high quality videos. Yeah, it's I, just I, yeah, not, yeah, 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 yeah. It's just a video where it's someone giving someone gifts. You enjoyed the penalties one though. I think if we did more really stuff like that, that, I think I really if we did more that. stuff like that and like the uh, bowling, then I think we'd be back on track. A hundred percent. But then it's like we get, you know, we film two days a week on side men. Mm -hmm. Then we'll also I'll have a day where I do reacts, and then I'll have yeah. a day where we do more side men. And then I'm like, okay, well now I've got one day left yeah and i need to film my second channel and stream yeah yeah I don't I'd, do it, i'd just rather take a day at home the scheduling is is the main problem because at the moment you've like, if i went back in our, our messages it would be like you saying hey should we do this and i'm like yeah cool when and then just no answer yeah. and then but it, like you sent me the mcdonald's thing the other day not yeah that you might not spoil it might well, do that i can say i want to go to uh the world's biggest mcdonald's is in orlando florida okay and it's it's <laughs> massive and it has like you can get pizza. Oh, you can Mc get pasta. McPizza, McPasta. Sure, because it's McDonald's. Although then now all I get is McDonald's TikToks. So now I want to mm -hmm. go to McDonald's headquarters and you can get everything from any everywhere. Well, I like to do also food videos. So if you go there, I'll film like not to just steal your shit, but I'll do like a food challenge. Did you feel ambitious though, saying to me that you wanted to do that though, knowing yes. with, knowing that your scheduling I was? was. My, well, then I looked at the flight time. I was like nine and a half hours. I was like, oh, am I going to do that? Wow. And I thought, if things slow down a little bit, then yes. Mm. But right now, yeah, there's no, there's no chance. It's massive. That's a, that's a good idea, good video. Yeah, but th again, like, yeah, to do a video that you want to, to do a video that you would want to hit your quality, like, ometer, quality ometer, is yeah, like a lot of effort now. But then I know everyone's reply will be, oh yeah, but you're posting a reaction on your second channel. Mm. Yeah. And I'm like, but my second channel that's is- where it belongs. Yeah, my second channel is what I do for fun. Yeah, yeah. Whereas yeah. my main channel, I feel like now, yeah, I need to. I feel like you like the game shows, but the game show suffers the same problem. I think the podcast suffers sometimes, which is organizing the guests. Yeah. Because you guys don't want to ask anyone to do anything. Yeah. So we can't but then, guests. Yeah. It's, uh, the more and more I think about it, though, the more I realize like people will do it and they'll enjoy oh, it. Oh, 100%. Because I podcast, think like they love it, Chris yeah. MD, I'm like, he, he sends me a message every like three days. Like these days, are you free? Can we film this video? Yeah. Um, it's always when Sidemen are filming. Mm. But then he has... Every video he has like eight guests. Like his last one, he does a day shoot with Freezy and uh, Reeve. Yeah. Then he does another day shoot with Danny Ahrens. Then he does another day shoot with Toby and Ben Foster. And then he does another shoot with um, Clarky and Arthur. Mad. And I'm literally like, that's so many guests, so many days. Yeah, yeah. And I'm scared to ask one person. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they'll do it, man. They'll for sure do it. Yeah. Mate, just, like, uh, like even like Harry loves the game shows. Like he says he <laughs> enjoy, enjoy, enjoys them. I think he likes uh, trivia related dude, things yeah. like that. But Danny Aaron's, he loves being on anything. He always says, oh yeah, I'll do it. I'll do that. Yeah. A bit desperate really, isn't he? He Danny is Aaron's. very desperate. Yeah. He's so funny. Yeah. Uh, he's That's a loser. Right. He's a right. big loser. Him. He's so great. <laughs> Actually, I don't want to say this because I saw this on Sidecast. He was saying how he wants to start boxing. And he was like, we, I need to build a narrative that like I have to hate someone. Oh. So the more I call him a loser, oh, I'm thinking he's going to start going, I'll box him. <laughs> he's going to latch on. Yeah. yeah, and I'm like, yeah. no, I'm not going to, I can't, no, I'm not doing that. Firstly, I'm not boxing. Secondly, it's Danny Aaron's. I don't think he could ever hate you. I love Danny he Aaron's. Said, he said the most wholesome thing about um, about uh, the, the charity match. He was talking about how, I think it was on Sidecast, but he was going, he said, for years, you know, I, I would, he would go to all the games and he'd watch them. He'd say to his dad, Dad, one day I'm going to be on that pitch. And then, and then apparently his dad, he was like, yeah, my dad was like, yeah, you will. And then he was. <laughs> That's really sweet. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> his mum his mom hugged me on uh, before that charity match, the last oh, one. What, what are you trying to say? Like, she was just like, oh, thank you so much for inviting oh, okay. him and blah, blah, blah. My favourite Danny Aaron's moment is when we were filming that North versus South Chris MD video and his, he throws his phone on the floor and then Swamp picks it up later and his background is him. <laughs> I've seen that, that in, so the in the charity match yeah, Bless yeah. Him, yeah. He's speaking a of him sorry there was a game yesterday 
Oh was yeah. A, oh, there was. There was a match. He scored. He scored a penalty. He scored a penalty. <laughs> mm. It's a banging penalty. The penalty's real. It's unbelievable. Put some power through that. You got a clip, Nick. Danny Aaron's. He tweeted it. I think. Man, Nick, Nick, well. I would search Danny Aaron's penalty. Man, and, his, and, his, <laughs> and as well, this podcast was his first proper outing into the world. For yeah, 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 yeah. Ever, yeah. ever. Yeah. <laughs> he never left his room for that. But this now he's not bare weight. He's in JJ's, a lot of JJ's videos early on doing yeah. calls. It actually works really hard, and he's got a good personality. He is really funny. Yeah. Look at this pen. Oh, John, I know you don't really know football, but this is a good pen. I'll let you know. Yeah, I'll be like, whoa, <laughs> this is incredible. Oh, he levered it. Better angle. I'm, I'm aware that the top corners is, is good. It's a good place to That's go. That's a good place to go, yeah. You can't reach it. <laughs> he does that. <laughs> Bro, when we were, I filmed the video with him where it was recreating Sideman Charity Match goals. Yeah. And there's one where it's like, the ball gets launched across the pitch and you have to bring it down and then lob the keeper. Mm -hmm. And he brings the ball, he brings the ball down then looks over at like me, Chris and Toby and just goes like this. And we're like, bro, you haven't scored the goal. You've done the, you've done the touch, like score the goal and then he misses the goal. Oh, God. But he's just looking at us. Yeah. Like, yeah. Classic Danny Aaron's man. Um, where, did, where, what were we talking about? We're talking about John, um, you know, in like filming, oh, filming videos. Yeah, but I will no, say I you're know, very hard working. Yeah. Thank you, I appreciate that. Can I say what he said about coming on here? I can say that, right? Go for it, let's oh. find out. Yeah, yeah. So we were like, um, well, we asked Nick, but Nick turned us down. Um, so then we had to go to John. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, that is how I went down. No, no, but, but just so you know, we would have chosen you anyway. But we Thanks. didn't. One off of this one for the no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, and John was like, oh, actually, I'd love to come on, but like, I'm obviously trying to, you know, well, so John films for us, right? So he was thinking, if I come on the podcast, I'm not going to make any money. Yeah, I need money for the baby. The baby <laughs> yeah, is very imminent. Like, so then we, obviously we were like, well, you we'll still pay you. You're still doing topics and stuff. Mate, and I'm, free, and I'm freelance. So when I take maternity, I, I just got to go off for two true, weeks. True. I just have two weeks off. But I look, I, it's so funny. It's so, like, it's like, it's just funny to me that like, going from there to there is going to cost you like money. <laughs> Mate, I, you, say, you say I'm hard working though, but I feel like that's just like anyone within like, I'm going to quit this it's, side bent ecosystem. Oh, uh, well, like, Apart from the Simon, <laughs> yeah. Well, they do, they do, they do. But no, but like, oh no, you're I, right. I feel like there's there's an e expectation because anyone who hasn't or starts not working hard just kind of isn't there anymore. Is yeah, that's how I'd yeah. say it just goes down. And and like, I find it it's very motivational because you can you could as well. You're given the opportunity to do anything. Like again, I just started carrying bags. Then I'm a cameraman. Then you're kind of letting me because direct like that um well, the penalty video. Essentially, I'm in charge of that. Yeah, and yeah, then yeah. for the game show, I'm writing questions. So you can. Tr Try anything, yeah. Which is what's great. Not like it's not like a normal job without you're going to do this for eight hours. Well, everyone watching this, you have to just take opportunities because even even I would say like I'm, I'm, I was joking before about saying we're Simon and you know, we're lazy. Like I'm not lazy though because if I was, I would, would not be here. You know, it's true. <laughs> yeah, I mean I, have, I live like so far away, <laughs> but like you have to take opportunities, right? If you get if you see one come up, you gotta take it. Oh yeah, you can't because you know. often like I used to be, I'd say I was like scared. If someone offered me something, I'd be scared to take it because even if I didn't know how to do it, but now I just figure it out yeah, like i'm take, just like yeah. you can figure it out yeah. and you, that's most people are doing that i know that's a common thing but yeah, yeah it's great i love it two segues here okay you came into the podcast <laughs> that's it um no you came into the podcast <laughs> at a time where sam and i were filming ourselves when was, when was the segue i'm getting there oh right sorry <laughs> when we were filming the segues normally before yeah yeah no, no, no it's like a okay well this is a bridge <laughs> right pre-chorus Pre-chorus, we were filming ourselves with a shitty little backdrop, and yeah, you know, and, de and there the oh, segue the then. The were decent. The segue then is we were did a, you did a Simon react so with me in it. Recently, I was a Simon react. I was oh, just, yeah, 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 yeah. I've reacted to it as well. Oh, not yeah. yet, but I will do. Okay, but like you know, for continuity yeah. purposes, um, I did watch it. Already. Is it going to be longer than eight minutes? Of course. Oh. Well, the reacts is longer. The reacts. Oh right. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. He might yeah. get bored though. And yeah, I'm not going to get bored of myself. I'm really funny. But no, but then I heard in the comments, read in the comments that you were slate in the set, the podcast set. No, I, so I'm with Ethan and Josh in it. But this one? No, no, no. Oh. The, well, well so me and Josh, it's me, Josh and Ethan. And I'm there's right, like, so yeah. uh, there's a few clips of us on the podcast. All right. And there's a couple with like the red curtain. Then there's the previous set. And there's this set. And uh, like... I can't. I think it's Ethan says like, "Thank God you got rid of that uh, those curtains." Like, look how shit this is. <laughs> okay. And I was like, "Yeah, but okay. you know, this cost us fifteen pounds. We did it in my like spare room, blah blah." blah. And then we saw the next setup, and he went, oh, "I fucking hate this setup." <laughs> this one? No, the previous one where the wood went. Didn't across. Line the wood was fake. It was laminate. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I fucking hate that. It didn't line that. up or anything. Yeah. And he was like, "Yeah, fucking hate this." And he got so angry about it. And I was like, "Hey, hey, look, it's a work in progress. Look at it now." What I laughed at the most was when it was Halloween episode. <laughs> little yeah, bucket they're like oh is this the Halloween episode and the only difference is this little like bucket like that do you know the, what that might have not been that that might have just been laziness and you guys I wanted said, to put I something think, in it I literally said I think that was actually the week after and we <laughs> just left it there 
Yeah, no, yeah. but I, I don't like looking at ones with the ones where it wasn't ooh, where it wasn't real wood. Yeah, like I hate yeah. I hate seeing that set because I, I was disappointed by that the whole time. Yeah, no, that set was. But, 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 but I'm sure I'll be disappointed by this when we go whenever the. Well, but then the, the next, next segue. See, I've pre-planned two segues. Okay. Is what what are you gonna do or what are we gonna do when we hit a million subscribers? Because we spoke about then that's when we're gonna change the set. So the next the next like iteration will be when we hit one mil. The issue is whenever we hit it. That, but we also can't plan when we hit it because we have to get it made. We have to get a whole new set well, made. I think what the, well, we're gonna, it's good if we start planning now because the problem has always kind of been that we've kind of just done everything on the fly as it's happening. So if we really plan this but one, like we should start uh, now, yeah, yeah, yeah we should start yeah. now. And I think we could like could even say to people who watch this podcast, if say if we put the dimensions of this room out and we put a, a tender saying, hey, does anyone want to see if they can three D model this? And if we pick you, then get well, paid or something. I yeah, don't but know. I think like we can do better than the audience, you know. Uh, who knows? You I'm know, joking. You, you could, you could I'm joking, man. <laughs> hey, I'm mate, this, there might be the best 3D modeler no, in, no, in the whole I'm UK I'm watching joking. this. Email us or comment, or comment down below. Oh, oh yeah. I'm a good guy. Yeah, you actually do. Yeah. yeah. Did my, like, studio. yeah. And bedroom and everything. Yeah. Okay, yeah. well, let's, let's get that then. Let's but, uh, we get some inspiration going. Yeah, that set up. But there has been an internal What's Good debate about how the next setup should look because you believe there should be a table. Well, let's listen, mate. It's not that deep, but like, I'm idea. interested. I don't care. I'll, I'll film I, I, it. I don't okay. care. The only thing I like about having a table set up is that, mm. like, when we're doing a podcast, we can look at each other. Mm. Like, I don't love doing this. I like the being able to look is, at each other. I feel like whatever podcast you're watching, you think is the best setup. Yeah, but I, no, no, no. It's but not. you change what podcast you're listening to. Yeah, or I do. Watching. I, I watch different ones because you'll be like, uh, you've seen certain ones like Joe Rogan's. At one point, you wanted a Joe Rogan setup. Well, yeah, but he's different. He's more like he's not that great of a set. It, no. they, they use like shitty cameras, but he's actually like- In terms of what it looks like. Yeah, but, oh, I, yeah, but I like well, how, yeah. well, his studio's unreal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but like, his actual set. But I just like how it's like um, the conversa conversational. Cause like, I don't, I don't love, I don't mind this, but I don't love how like, we're like, it's like, a, it's like Sky Sports. <laughs> I mean, I want, I, want, I want the conversation to be- Sky Sports to be, is great. It's a good show, good show. <laughs> I froze up. But I want to be, I want to be like, <laughs> no, if, if John's a guest, I want to be like this, you know, I want to be like, Staring at me the whole time. Yeah. Okay. You know? Yeah. Well, someone said this is more like a, a talk show than a podcast. Yeah, I don't like that. And you don't like that. Okay. No, so that's, that's, podcast, good to, that's good know? to understand. Okay. That, yeah, which was isn't it? And Nick said that. But if it is us sat across from each other, it'll be very like, it's not laid back. Well, that's where, that's where, when I say table, I think you guys think I want it to be like really uptight. That's not the case. I don't mind it being like, you know, we can sit on beanbags if we want to. <laughs> but I'm just saying like, we'll, we'll, we'll figure out. I you think guys the, know what you think in the I comments. I think the table everyone facing each other uh, brings about more like an interview style thing where yeah. you're, yeah, like where it's a bit, the tone's a bit more serious. I, I, I don't care about, in, I, don't, I don't want that tone. I want, I want it to be comfortable still because I, like mm. I like the comfort that people have, but I also want it to be more just like, you know, conversational. Yeah, but you're always going to have, okay, so say we're sat across the table from each other, we're looking at each other. Mm -hmm. Where's the guest? Next yeah, that's to one problem. of us, that's right? That's a problem, that's a problem, yeah. And if you're next to each other, then this person's going to have to be like this. Yeah, yeah, that is a problem. Yeah. But we can figure it out. We can figure it out. We can go, well, that was in the comments. Well, I, but like, for example, sometimes now, I'm like, just looking around. Do you know what I'm saying? Look at all these conversations That's you, though. No, but what, what do you want me to do? No, but, <laughs> no, as in that's just- I'm like, exactly from his line. Bro, you can't get through- <laughs> Yeah. You can't get through a six minute video. Like, True. of course yeah. you're gonna look around. No, but, 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 no, 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 but I, but I love conversations. I can sit and talk for hours. Yeah. It's not, it's not the same as watching a video. video yeah, yeah video. the lack of sleep probably doesn't help the attention span either. Yeah. Come on, man. It's not bullied Randolph hour. <laughs> <laughs> no, the lack of sleep is bad. I will fix it guys, which is it's situational. Oh. Well, I wanna know what is the worst thing about filming with the sideband? Also for that, um, with what, with one, <laughs> With one meal on, on what's good as well. Can we do a merch drop? Can I work on a merch drop? Yeah. Sick yeah, bang. It's yeah. coming soon, guys. Yeah. That's my ideas. Okay. That's your idea. Back on. Um, oh, I have, we, we'll do it as well, me and you. Yeah, yeah. You want to do slides, right? Yeah, big time. Slides. <laughs> slides coming. I like um, how you're like, I'm not going to say what it is on here. And then you're just like, we'll do slides. <laughs> Can't help myself. So there's two things. Okay. Um, one is when two side men both have different ideas about something and they want you to convey that to the other side man, but they'll say, <laughs> they say no. Essentially, like I'm in between okay. two of you <laughs> who are like- Go on, give us an example. It okay, so the me. example is almost the, the second thing, and this is the thing I hate most about Sidemen, is Sidemen refusing to use their vlog cameras. Yeah, because as well, that is the, the, the one will be like, no, they have to use them on this shoot. Otherwise we're not going to get the car. And I'm like, okay, sure. And then I go and I turn up and say, it's hey, true. use this. And they, and then like, there are a couple, there are a couple of, of side men who, are, like, who are just like, can I, can I guess who I hate doing I, it? I can't confirm or deny. <laughs> can I guess who hates doing vlog cameras? You can cameras? guess. I'm like, not gonna answer though. Vic hates vlog cameras. It could be. Oh, that's not answer. Say Josh. Josh. It could be. That means uh, <laughs> that means no. Yeah, some oh. people don't. Some people de definitely don't like vlogging. But again, like, say so on like the hot camping, right? 
everyone vlogged there and that was great for me. But if, if they hadn't, like the other team had three cameramen and it was just me. So sometimes you like I need the sidemen to build it up. And also I feel like it creates the original, the, the most viewed video on the channel is the holiday video. Yeah. And a lot of that was vlogged. Well, and I that think was, that style well, people like. Vlogged. Pretty much. It was all vlogged. Yeah. yeah. That's, a diff- that's a difference, I think. Because like, I think even even if I'm in a video for Sidemen, sometimes I think like, I obviously I'm always going to vlog, but also you can be funnier and more in the video if you're not holding the camera. Because you've got to think about where I'm, what yeah. I'm doing. You can be like funnier and you can actually- If I see- hold it, I've only got this much in. Whereas yeah, if you're yeah. filming me, I've got a whole body in so I can do something. And you're worried yeah. as well. Like you're worried, have I got everything in? So it's like, you're also looking at the camera and taking away from actually being present. See, but Josh brings up a different thing. Then when we're doing like these, um, like it's like a whole day video, not like, uh, like so maybe what you're talking about might be a hide and seek where everyone's feeling themselves, right? Sorry, yeah. If they- <laughs> <laughs> but Bad example but, on my end, my God, my bad. But, if, but what Josh says is that um, you can just, you guys can choose to be funny. Instead of me being like, be funny now. Yeah, 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 it's yeah, better because you guys yeah. kind of be like, oh, I have a really funny thing to say and that kind of comes from just nothing. Which both is, work in different I mean, don't get me wrong. Yeah, both I agree times. there should be more vlog yeah. content. I also stand by that. Um, it <laughs> is just a case of everyone has to be in the right mood. Yes. Because that's, that's yeah. one of my biggest pet peeves is how I'm included in this. The mood can change so quick, which completely changes the video. Mm. That's why I'm a very like, these, the bad v good teams, have to be very carefully planned in terms of you have to get the bad team not in a too much of a bad mood that they don't want to do it because mm-hmm. if they don't want to do it then they'll just go no nah, stop the camera like i'm not doing anything and there's no content yeah so you have yeah. to make it bad enough because some people in some comments just want to see the bad team suffer they don't want it to be funny mm-hmm. they just want suffering yeah <laughs> yeah yeah i see that so if it was actual just suffering there wouldn't be content because the people wouldn't want to do it yeah i agree on a real though, I love every other element of it. I can't oh, lie. You don't make a promotion, mate. No, I just, just <laughs> I'm joking. Oh, I, was, I wasn't even like no one laughs, so it's just me <laughs> now. No. So I'll ask him a question about the side, man. Okay, what is, in your opinion, the? Why do you think the side men have got to where they are at, based on what you know from them being there close to the filming day in day out? Um, you other can than say KSI, uh, if you other, want to say other, well, yeah, that does help a lot. But other than just the grind and how much they, you know, again, the factory and all that. I think one thing that people don't talk about a lot is that there's just being completely like apolitical. Like they just get on with making content. You know what I mean? You guys aren't, you like genuinely, even in your personal lives, aren't really interested oh. in these, in topics. Like, oh, I was going to bring this up to you actually. Yeah, the people, because I, because I love, you know, I'm interested in like talking about politics and like, but yeah, it doesn't do yeah, anything yeah, for my yeah. life. It doesn't, you know, it's not really fulfilling and I just end up like debating people for no real reason. But you guys have zero interest in that and I think it makes you more productive and I think that's part of the reason. It's also brand friendly, which helps, you know, because then you can never, you know, you're never alienating anyone. So being apolitical is like, again, I, I just think that's one that people haven't brought up. That's true, because I was going to say to him in the intro, I was like, John's a very opinionated person, so it's perfect for the podcast. Because sometimes we'll have debates, and I'm like, I just don't care. Not I don't care, but I don't have an opinion. Yeah, like, yeah. I, have, I have no opinion on the matter. Yeah, but, I have loads um, of useless opinions. I will, yeah, I'd agree. Yeah. yeah. No, no, no. I was, I was, I was, I was, no, it's not use, useless. Well, no, but then what I mean in terms of like, what, what I said about the boy is more it makes him productive. It makes, it's less productive for me to, you know, what have I got out of really oh, these okay, debates? Yeah. Not yeah. much. Yeah, you know? there's, no, there's no point dwelling on something that's not going to change. Anything, exactly, so and just... nothing you, you can change out in the world. Were you surprised at like how involved they were? Evolved or in- in- involved. involved? Like when um, it first started, obviously. Because no. it was quite a big company at still at that point. Not mm. in terms of how many people we had working for us, but... Stakes. Like, yeah, the production was still decent level. It was, you know, the channel was still big. And yet when you filmed that first video, it was pretty much all still mm. entirely us. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, I think I think that just is in general what always made it uh, better than normal film production, right? Yeah. Because because the client is you guys, so if you know you are mediating the content as it's going on, rather than like five other people trying to trying to uh, do it because of the budget or because of like you know being sensitive or something, you guys just go, no, we like this, we'll do this. I, I mean, and as well, that just adds to the success of it. That's why it's successful is because you guys are directly yeah. involved. It doesn't surprise him. Well, I think that's why also con and yourself and what con like the team con's built filming mm. wise has helped a lot because i remember when you guys first filmed anyway when it wasn't con yeah no offense to that team but like that was more scripted in a way that was more of them being like let's how how can we work this out where i, can't, I feel like con um, has let you guys okay well, we didn't I'm, really have anything before you like did. we you had, had one yeah remember that well, the, you remember the sumo suit video yeah but that was our idea that was we had filmed with reka reka and we were like we want to film a reka reka style video yeah but, but i feel like Okay, yeah, I get that. But I do feel Con is more like 
he's more adaptable to what you guys want to do. That, that's exactly what I was going to say. I think what being a good YouTube cameraman like in the Sidemen version is, is being reactionary. You just yeah. need to be able to just quickly just change things up at the last minute because we don't do second takes or anything like that. So you need to make sure you capture it in whatever way it is. Yeah. Although I will call Con out. Sometimes he does that. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes he goes, "Can you do that again?" Yeah, yeah. And everyone goes, "Con, the moment's gone." Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, but, but at least, but at least you got the comfort with Con to know you can say that. Yeah. But yeah, if you yeah, had yeah. someone else, that was maybe a bit, a bit don't get wrong. Professional. I'm, I'm not slating. No, of course, Con's well, very good. I, I am. Con's awful. <laughs> <laughs> no, Con's great. But yeah, having that comfort's nice because if you have like a boffin, they like actually know you know this should be shot like this. And you're like, mm. No, it's a video, mate. Calm down. Con's, con. Con's kind of done the thing w with me that Mr. Beast said on the sidecast because you guys were talking about getting the right people to try and do things and Mr. Beast was saying how he, he couldn't find anyone and that's because these skills don't exist. Like being a YouTube cameraman or a YouTube producer is different from being yeah. a ch standard film industry one. Um, and so he's, Mr. Beast is just taking the training on me, starting them college courses, I think, and stuff like that. And essentially, the first two years, Con was like my, he was my mentor, he was my teacher. So he mm -hmm. just taught me everything I just copied. I don't know anything that Con doesn't, no, basically now at this point. All right, that's what wait. I'd say. I'd no, wait, yeah, okay, that, yeah. yeah, no, no, that works. Yeah, that yeah, works, yeah. yeah. Con, you fired me. <laughs> Chose no, a no, new no, guy. It sounded no. like that. But it was. No, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. All I know is, is based what, on what Con knows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Con knows everything you know. Yeah. There's not one yeah. thing Con can do that I can't do. <laughs> no, but I think that's changing. By the way, I think now YouTube is a job now, isn't yeah. it? Like an analysts, you got. Although what. I'm starting to get sick of these analysts on Twitter. You're not on Twitter. I'm, I'm not, yeah, I agree with you already. I know yeah, what you're going to yeah. say. There are some amazing ones. There are some unreal ones who know what they're talking about. But what I hate is when someone will analyze Mr. V's thumbnail and they're like, this thumbnail bang because of this, this, this. I'm like, yeah, it's got 100 million views. Like, you don't have to analyze you, you it. You know it's, it's bang. Do, yeah. That's find, one that's, find one that's failed and say why it's I failed. I don't believe, uh, I know there are analysts that are good. Yeah. Technically good. Yeah. I still don't believe in it. Yeah. I still don't believe that like, I know Mr. Beast, he's, he said on a podcast, like, oh, I started working with a channel and mm. since working with them, they've gone from like 4 million views earning $10,000 to 200 million views earning $700,000. Yeah. And I'm like, fair enough. But everyone thinks that that's Eric, in which case, you know, the videos have got 10 times better, yeah. bigger budget. Yeah, he's yeah. been in more sure, yeah. videos. Like, it's obvious why. Mm -hmm. I just think it's easy to say it once you've done it. I, I think that as well. There, there are things like titles you can improve, something else you can improve. Like yeah, for sure. In, intros and hooks and like the retention and stuff. But also at the same time, like... But then sometimes it's not because... Yeah, yeah. yeah. You like, you would say, okay, uh, call this video... Stick and movies. <laughs> that is true. Though. That is true. <laughs> true. That is true. That's but like, call this it. video, you know, like, oh, uh, uh, I sp uh, the most extreme 24 hours in Thailand. Yeah, yeah. And you'd think, oh... That would do better than uh, eating Thai food type beat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Con did that and the video started doing better with better, the, the yeah. worst title. Yeah. And See, then I every analyst would tell you that title over this title. Yeah. And then he's changed it to that and it's- See, it'd be problem. more impressive if the analysts could, using all what exists, come up with something new. If they could predict, that's how a good a a analysis would work. Well, if you and could and predict something no one's done, but yeah. it'd be good based on X. And that's what they, I think they do that. I think the ones that actually work with creators, the ones who actually do join as like consultants and stuff, I think they do that. They'll look at the channel and they'll say, right, this is what I think this channel needs rather than go in. Like, say, you take a, say you take a daily vlog, like Casey Neistat, right? Yeah. Say if he started turning his videos into like Mr. Beast style videos, it'd be awful. Because his yeah. videos are about storytelling, like, you know, whereas Mr. Beast is still storytelling, but it's very different way. Yeah. Whereas what the consultants are going to do, they're going to go into Casey Neistat's ch channel and just take away everything that he has that is himself that's, to be the new style. Not everyone's like that. That's what I mean. If I had a, if I hired an analyst from my main channel, I wouldn't do a game show. There'd yeah, be no yeah, game yeah. show. Like, yeah, be, yeah, you can't do this. Yeah. It'd be like, okay, let's do this. I don't know, let's, I can't think of a video right now, but you know what? The videos wouldn't be what I want to do. Yeah. Mm. In which case you're just creating another person. And everyone becomes the same. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Whereas the whole point of YouTube is, be different. you know, like, yeah, I enjoy doing the game shows, so I'm going to do a game show. Yeah. And the people that want to watch it, watch it. That's a, there's a reason it doesn't get 50 million views because mm -hmm. not that many people want to watch it. But Yeah, and, and like Mr. Beast, like he he did his style of content actually when that wasn't a thing, right? Like he actually, well, it was still a thing, but he he did like take that style and kind of yeah. ran with it. Same with like Ryan Trahan, right? He kind of did that as well. And Ryan, by the way, Ryan Trahan, I reckon if he had an analyst at the start, they would not have not told him to do what he did. You know, he's like, yeah, probably, yes. Whereas, but then now- Because that wasn't, no, no. Yeah, but then now they'll look at him and they'll point out why that did so well. Mm. I'm like, well, yeah, but if you- Yeah, retroactively. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. his- can you go on that Penny series quick? I feel like the titles weren't, the titles weren't good. Yeah. I don't believe so, no. Well, no, sorry, you mean they weren't good like technically? Yeah. They obviously were good. Yeah. Because they did well. 
Well, yeah, but the I could down quite a bit. There you go. Yeah, the same title with just every day. day. Yeah, yeah. Where admittedly, I, I what they all say is what any analyst will say is, oh, you know, once he had the first four or five days people got addicted to the series so they want to see the series name. Yep, yep. It's like, well, you're saying it now. Yeah, imagine- If they started flopping, yeah. you would say, oh, it's because of the title. <laughs> if he had like 20 million views on the video, or videos and he got like, he got 500K, they would go, oh, I don't think you should change the titles. You know? Yeah. But it's but, like, that's why I love YouTube though, because everything's di different. But it's just, it's just, it's getting tiring all the analysts, you know? Not the analysts, but the threads on Twitter and what they're saying, it's like, it's getting, it's, it becomes a bit of an echo chamber, you know? That's Is not the series, by the way. No, it's- You had it though. You had it, it was the other one. Yeah. He did uh, too, but we're talking about the the Mr. that thirty days one there. Mm. I see. I look at these analysts a lot. Does any of them go as deep as like personality? Like, because because they analyze why certain personalities do better, or is it all just about how they're conveying it's the always, content? Like, it's about you can change the personality on camera, yeah. but they won't say, "Oh, your personality is better." Yeah, like it would be more like, "Oh, you need to, for example, the side men need to." We already know if we wanted to be bigger, we would have to make our humor way less uk yeah yeah because yeah. we have so many uk style jokes or mm -hmm. slang or whatever we say yeah we can't break america with that yeah but that's also what makes your brand so loyal you know? yeah and it's like would if we go and do that just to get ourselves bigger then it becomes a proper job where we're not actually making what we want we're just going okay we have to turn up all right everyone turn turn on your camera self yeah mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, true. But I also want to say it's not all analysts, you know. I'm just saying like- Oh yeah. The, the, it's the few yeah. that just do the same old shit. Hmm. Um, but yeah. I feel like, are we okay with time? What's going on? Uh, yeah, we, we, we do need to run downstairs yeah. and do a side cast now. Yeah. Oh we, my God, yeah. yeah. Blame the, um, Blame fire, the fire, alarm. fire alarm, man. Yeah. Yeah. 20 minute delay. Yeah. Selfish fire. How dare it. Although the fire, like people did walk out and go. <laughs> so oh, for those listening on audio, I shrug my shoulders. The fireman asked if it was in a food shop opposite. <laughs> yeah, it's like he walked past and was like, "Oh, is it in here?" <laughs> so I'm, I, you, tell you, us, man. Yeah. <laughs> you know where the fire is. M mildly listen, concerning. Listen to where the alarm's going off. Yeah, yeah. But um, well, thanks for having me on, guys. Thanks for coming no, on. Actually, thank you. Oh. I, I hope you. No, I was joking earlier when I said it's just John. No, I don't. But it's okay. Really? No, oh. I'm joking. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm actually, joking. I actually, I'm, I'm, actually, I'm joking. No, no, no. I had a good time. Well, cool. thanks for coming on, and as usual. I have an Instagram. There you go. Come on, Cam. I'd like to get brand deals because I like money. So that would be okay. cool. Nice. So that would be good. What is it? It's John on Cam. John nice. on Cam. He posts pictures of behind the scenes of Sidemen as well. So yeah. a lot so of likes. Therefore, yeah. You get a lot of likes. Yeah. And if but I get- I mean, if you want to see more stuff behind the scenes. Then yeah, yeah. And if I get brand deals, I'll hire a guy to do reels as well. That'd be great. You should do, do it for four, man. I should do it for deep end, yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. Yeah, Prove right. to them what you're going to offer them. All right, cool. I'll, yeah. I'll work on it. Well, everyone go follow him. Woo! Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for listening. And we'll see you next week. Peace. Peace. Bye. Sick, sick. Woo!